Hi guys, welcome to the new vlog. So now me and my boyfriend, we're gonna go to town center to get some coffee and we're gonna go for a little walk. Also, we need to do some food shops, so we're gonna go to Asda. Also, I forgot to tell you, today is Monday and if you saw my last vlog, I vlogged yesterday, which was Sunday. And yesterday was actually a very nice day. It was sunny, so we went to the beach and we tanned for a bit. And today, it looks very different. Today is cloudy and much colder. I think it's about 19 degrees today. So it's a little bit colder than yesterday. And all this week doesn't look like we're gonna have any more beach days. I mean, we'll see, but so far it just looks like 17, 18 degrees. Not really a summer weather. <laughs> now we are going to the beach. And as you can see, it's a little bit cloudy, but actually it's quite warm because barely any wind. Also, I forgot to show you my outfit. I'm wearing this shirt, not shirt, top, which I got in one of the Mallorca markets and H&M stripy trousers, which feels very light and comfortable. So yeah, if the sun will come out, actually it would be really hot because now I do feel quite warm, but I don't think it's gonna get sunny because there is lots of clouds. But as I said, there is like barely any wind, so it's like feels like humid, like quite warm. So now we're gonna go this zigzag down to the beach. I don't know if you can hear on the camera this bird so loud as it is. Also, there is some ships over there. Now we just came down to the beach and it's not many people not like comparing on when it was saturday no not saturday anyways last week it was like really busy when the weather was nice now we're just passing bournemouth wheel and look at the clouds it looks like rain clouds even though it's not supposed to rain today so now we're gonna go to a couple of shops and to get coffee I just got vegan sausage roll from Greg's and now we're gonna go to Cafe Nero to get some coffee. I got the honey ice latte with cream. I had a little accident in a coffee shop. I spilled the whole coffee, but <laughs> they got me a new one. Now we came to Primark because my boyfriend wanna see what shoes they have and I'm just looking for some reusable straws, so I'm gonna go and see if they have anything. Now we have blue color beach bags, but we don't have any like colorful bags because I'm looking for some nice color bags for summer, but we don't really have anything. Everything is just either black, white, or beige. I bet these smells very nice. Also, we have some cute candles. These are five pounds. These watermelon ones are nice. Oh, look at this. This is cute. Also, not sure what this is like. Light? Yeah. Look at these small cactuses. Looks very cute. Am I gonna get one? So I can put under my TV. These are only two pounds. So I'm not gonna get this one. Also, I love these mirrors, but to be honest, I do think they would hold on the wall with only these stickers. We also have these in pink ones. These are very cute. We're just coming to dive one to man section to look for some shoes. Something like this, but not ugly. <laughs> this is not ugly. Half slippers. <laughs> now we are coming back from town and we're gonna go to do some shopping in Asda. Asda does now this huge discount. 60p from £2.50. That's crazy. 
and there's one kilo so we got the last two boxes oh we have some more over there we just came back home and i'm gonna show you what we got in asda in a second but first i wanted to show you this toilet paper i got from a tiktok shop and you're not gonna believe this i got for one pound 75 it's 60 rolls and i think it's quite a good toilet paper <laughs> so yeah also i got these couple things from primark as i showed you i got this small cactus and this sweater as it was on discount from 13 pounds i think yeah from 13 pounds to seven pounds i wanted to get in a size medium but they had only size small left but i love this color okay so this is our as a shopping i'm gonna show you what we got so i got some corn crispy nuggets these are really good corn fillets you can fry them or boil them then i got some picnic eggs some normal eggs i got some garlic bread this one actually is really good it's cheap but it's good then i got some chickpeas i'm gonna make chickpea curry today as i got some leftovers leftover rice from yesterday then i got barista oat milk some green tea avocados beetroots these are really good for making salads bananas apples cucumber bread then we got peanut butter this one organic one so we got two of these then i got some um tomato sauce i always buy this one this one is like the best tomato sauce it's no added sugar i always make like pasta or rice curries <laughs> basically just like anything with the sauce so it's usually always on discount either or two for three pounds or 150 so now i was on discount from two pounds to 150 and we got this pasta as i showed you for 60p for one kilo so we got two of these and i got some pastries on discount it was 73 pence these are like apple apple something yeah apple so yeah this is all the shopping we did today i just made dinner and it's kind of like a curry so i got garlic bread rice avocado um tomato sauce which i showed you before and i just chopped some fresh tomatoes and what else just some spices and chickpeas so yeah this is kind of like a chickpea curry and it's really good very easy to make but very delicious i'm going to make banana bread since i have these ripe bananas so i'm gonna use some sugar two eggs butter flour and baking powder guys as you saw i just made banana bread and now i just had a quick shower i'm gonna go to make eggs for breakfast and banana bread should be ready soon as well i just changed into this comfortable outfit because i need to clean my flat i need to do some deep cleaning in the kitchen so today just gonna be day at home doing some cleaning and i hope you like this kind of content Okay, this is what we're working with. First, I need to do the dishes from this morning banana bread. And sort about the noise because washing machine is going. And then I'm going to need to clean all the cupboards. So this one, this one, these drawers. Actually, it's even embarrassing to show. But I don't even know where to start. Maybe from this cupboard because this is really stressing me out. 
there's just a lot going on and nothing is organized yeah i need to go through all of this clean the shelves and do some kind of like organizing because i don't have much space so yeah and then i need to clean this drawer because as you see it's really really messy it's lots of spices there so i need to take all those spices and clean the whole tray then in here actually well i don't know it's not too bad but i guess i just need to go through this drawer and fold everything nicely this one i guess it's okay maybe i just need to clean this tray i don't know about the fridge probably need to clean fridge as well organize a bit because it's very messy like i said it's even embarrassing to show but i mean it's reality you know it's not like instagram perfect it's just the reality of life so you need to organize that as well Okay, I just finished cleaning and organizing these two cupboards. So now it just looks so much better. So here I just got some baking stuff, some protein powder and containers, and here just some baking tray, scales. So yeah, much more better in this one. On the first shelf, I got kind of like a desserts, nuts, peanut butter, that kind of stuff. Here, just some pasta, rice, any like grains. And in the last one, just random cans. I don't know, but I feel like it is much more organized and now I know where anything is. So yeah, much, much better. Now I'm gonna go and organize and clean this drawer with spices. I cleaned all the cupboards and now I'm gonna ask my boyfriend to help me to clean the kettle. I know it's very easy, but I never clean by myself and I'm gonna make him to show on camera as well. Now we're going to clean the kettle with this powder, uh, citric acid, or oh, how is it called? Citric acid. Yeah, so you can order this from Amazon. Well, step one, open the kettle, take out the filter, wash it off. How much water we need? Up to the level of lime scale. So in our case, it was about here somewhere. And then one spoonful of citric acid. Set it to boil and watch the magic happen. Now, pour it out and simply rinse it off. And this one, you said it's used for food? Yeah, it's food grade, so you don't need to do anything else. Wait, like in, in what food? And cooking some kind of... Uh, I'm not sure in what, but I know it's food grade. And there you go, clean kettle. Wow, this just looks like new now. Now I'm just making myself lunch. I got this pepper for quite a while, so I need to use it. So I'm gonna do pasta with a couple of fresh tomatoes 
gonna fry this pepper and just going to finish this tomato sauce and just gonna add some cheese so i feel like that's kind of like easy and quick lunch now i need to go and take a picture of the jacket because i want to sell it on vintage because i'm not really wearing it anymore so Hi guys, so it's the next day. As you saw yesterday, I was posting a jacket on Vinted and I already sold it. Also, I sold a summer dress. So now I'm gonna go and pack them and then I'm gonna go and send them. So I sold this dress from this brand. I don't know, I'm not really wearing this anymore because it's quite short, but it is quite a nice dress. And this jacket is from Primark. So yeah, I made 11 pounds from these two. Okay, so this is my outfit and I'm gonna take this jacket because I think it's quite chilly outside. I think today is about 17 degrees. It doesn't feel like summer at all. Now we are just coming down to Bormit Beach for a little walk and then we're gonna go around town center and before going home we're gonna go to buy a couple things in Lidl. Today looks like there is barely any people, it looks very calm. So to go on this wheel, it costs 10 pounds per person. Careful. How did you get this? On uni days, it's free donut on Thursdays. From Krispy Kreme. Yeah, from uni days, free donut. It's very fresh, very soft. Bubblegum. This one smells very, very sweet. Maybe actually we should take this. Some used batteries. Here? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Batteries. We just came back home and I think I'm going to finish this vlog here because I want to start editing this video. So thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye!